Hi everyone, welcome to Wedra Studio. Today, we are going to talk about argon. So now let's get straight to it. Argon is a noble gas, belonging to group 18 of the periodic table. A typical argon atom has 18 protons, 18 electrons and 22 neutrons. Other siblings include helium, neon, krypton, xenon, and radon. The name argon is derived from the Greek word argus, meaning lazy or inactive, reflecting its lack of reactivity. Argon was discovered in 1894 by the British scientist Lord Rayleigh, John William Strutt, and the Scottish chemist Sir William Ramsey, when studying atmospheric gases. For their discovery of argon and investigations on the density of the important gases, the pair each received the Nobel Prize in 1904, Rayleigh for physics and Ramsey for chemistry. Argon is the third most abundant gas in the Earth's atmosphere, making up about 0.93% of the Earth's air. Despite its relatively low concentration in the atmosphere, argon still contributes to the planet's mass and density. Did you know that argon-40 is the most common isotope of argon, making up about 99.6% of natural argon? It is used to date geological events, particularly the eruption and cooling of igneous rocks and minerals. Under normal conditions, argon is a colorless, odorless, and tasteless gas. Although argon is non-toxic, it is 38% more dense than air, and therefore considered a dangerous asphyxiant in closed area. Argon is monatomic, exists as single atom. The intermolecular forces of attraction are very weak, hence the very low melting and boiling points at minus 189.4 degrees Celsius and minus 185.8 degrees Celsius. Argon has approximately the same solubility power as oxygen. It is sparingly soluble in water and is 2.5 times more soluble in water than nitrogen. As a noble gas, argon is inert and generally does not readily form chemical compounds with other elements. It is characterized by its stable, full electron configuration in the outermost shell. Argon remains stable in various environmental conditions. It does not undergo combustion and is not flammable. Did you know that argon ionizes into plasma, causing luminescence effect when electricity runs through it? It produces only the upper spectrum colors on the visible light spectrum, resulting in a beautiful blue light glow. This property is also used by sign makers to produce a pleasing and eye-catching blue color, enhancing the visual appeal of neon signs. Being an inert noble gas, argon has various applications in different industries. It is commonly used as a shielding gas for arc welding for better stability, improved weld quality, and reduced spatter and fumes. Argon is often used as a filling mixture in fluorescent and incandescent light bulbs, preventing the tungsten filament from oxidizing and hence extending the bulb's life. It is also used in analytical instruments as a carrier gas in chromatography, a technique used for separating and analyzing chemical compounds. Argon has been explored for medical applications, including its potential use in cryosurgery. Extremely cold argon gas is used to freeze and remove abnormal tissue, such as cancer cells. In the food industry, argon is used to displace oxygen in packaging material to extend shelf life. By creating an oxygen-free environment, aerial oxidation and hydrolysis that degrade the products are prevented entirely. Did you know that argon has been used to preserve historical documents and artifacts? By creating an environment with controlled oxygen levels, argon helps to slow down the deterioration of materials. Since 2002, the American National Archives stores important national documents such as the Declaration of Independence and the Constitution within argon-filled cases to inhibit their degradation. Well, that's all for today and thanks for watching. If you like our video, please click the like and subscribe button below. We'll see you in the next video.